welcome to a Claire Chatter's Vlogmas episode two. I love how most of you noticed that I did the Star Wars scroll at the beginning each time I do episodes because it's like Star Wars. We were doing episode numbers and Star Wars is out in a few weeks so there's a theme going. <laughs> anyway, it's the 4th of December. How are we all doing? Are we in the festive spirit yet? As you can see, my tree is still bare and I'm thinking tonight might be the night that I decorate the tree. I'm, at, I'm, I'm definitely gonna get them out from under the stairs. I'm gonna get all the decks out, show you everything that I've got. And then fingers crossed by the end of tonight or at least tomorrow, the tree will be done. Fingers crossed. I've been at work all day, it's seven o'clock now. So we can do this, let's do this. It's the fourth. I want to make sure the tree is as beautiful for as long as possible because Christmas is in 20 days now, 21 days till Christmas day, which is just madness. Uh, but let's start off by doing the, the old Where's Wally advent calendar though. Um, oh, I forgot to say, I couldn't find the key like I was telling you in the first Vlogmas on my first day. Um, but when I was editing that video, I found it and let me show you where it is because it was so hard to find. I'll get up close to show you. So it is just in this corner. Oh my gosh, don't tell me I've lost it again. <laughs> oh, here it is. Right there. But that is so tricky out of all that, that tiny little key. Um, I've actually only done two. Uh, my, the 2nd of December was a camera, which I found pretty quickly. Um, I forgot to do yesterday's. Yesterday I was really busy at work. I got home, pretty much watched I'm a Celebrity and went straight to sleep. It was a very busy day. Is anyone watching I'm a Celeb, by the way? Are you enjoying it? Anyone from the UK? Let me know who you want to win. My favourites are um, Kate, Roman and Nadine. I love them. Right. Find the man with the umbrella for the third. Oh, it's like a, a cheap Mary Poppins. Right, this should be easy because that's gonna be pretty big, surely. There he is. Found him. What have we got? It's a little elf. Lovely. Number four. Find the Santa with the floppy hat. I love that so many of you have messaged me saying that you've bought this because of me and my vlogmases over the past few years and that you're playing along with me and stuff. Thank you so much. I love that. And a few of you messaged saying, have you found this yet? I can't find this. And oh, it's so such a fun thing to talk about. Wow. Well, I definitely skipped a lot of time then that you did not see because I took an embarrassing long time to find him, but he's here. There he is. It's, it was because it was on the edge of a door and that was kind of slightly open, so I missed it. I'm just using that as an excuse. But I'm very happy that it's quite difficult this year because last year, as you saw, it was a doddle. So yeah, very happy with that. Right, all four doors are open. So I'm gonna go and get all the stuff out from underneath the stairs. Actually, shall I show you the Star Wars advent calendar? I've not shown you what Simon's had, have I? Let me show you that. He's already opened it and created it. He loves it. So you saw him get this one on the first day, but now he's got, I think this is Kylo Ren's ship, or it's a, I don't know. I wish it said like, on, the, on the doors what exactly it is, or maybe they think that if you bought this, then you need to know what they are. Um, but we got a gun, I think that was today's, and then yesterday's was a little stormtrooper. How cool is that? And then this one, was so cool. Yesterday, look at the size that I had a full on teddy bear, it was so sweet. Um, three was another little ball. Number four, oh, it looks like another ball, doesn't it? Oh, it's a Lindor one. Yum. Right, so this is what we are looking at. We've got a bag there. I'm just using my phone as a torch. This bag, we've got a box, another box, and then there's another box. A bag of, I think that's Christmas cushions. And then we've got the wreath in this box. So I'm going to get all this out, have a look through it all. Right, I've got all the boxes out and some bags. It really is amazing how much you forget what you have because it's been 12 months without seeing it. I just found some lovely bits and pieces and I was like, oh, I forgot about those. Um, so I was about to start off with putting the wreath on the door because I found our wreath, but I can't find the hook that 
you hang it up on. I'm hoping it's in one of these boxes, <laughs> fingers crossed. But this is our wreath, it's from Inspirations. It was, I bought it when I went to the event last year. They held an event to show, sort of show off their new products. And it's so beautiful, it's got like snow and berries. This is it, I love it so much. So I wanna get that on the door pretty soon. It will, as soon as we find the, the hook really. Right, I've put the two boxes up on the sofa so I can look through. This is a, um, a table runner, but I haven't got a dining table for it yet. Maybe one day if we ever get a bigger house, but we'll keep it in here for now. Ah, that's right. This is just baubles for the tree, if I remember rightly. Look at these old Disney store boxes. Um, so I'm hoping the hook's going to be in this one. Oh, a little tree. Put that in the windowsill. Can't remember where I put everything last year. Can anyone see a hook? It's like, where's Wally all over again? Well, I've looked in both of these and the hook is not in there. I'm hoping it might be under the stairs still. So I won't panic yet. I just thought, oh, let's start with getting some cushions out instead just to get rid of some of these bags. We've got the Tours the Night Before Christmas and it's Mickey and it matches this sofa perfectly. Perfect. I'll place it properly later. I've got this one, which is a lovely reindeer. Oh, it's a bit creased. We've got all the Christmas plush. Oh, so cute. We've got a Mickey. And another Mickey. I don't even remember where I got that one. Must have been Disney Store. A mini. Oh, look at Olaf with his little Christmas hat on. We've got a Pascal with a little Christmas hat on. Floating lights, you're gonna love that. <laughs> and then, yeah, Daisy and Donald. I think I just had them in that corner. I'm gonna put them there now. <laughs> Look at this little Christmas family. Well, that's one bag empty. <laughs> oh, this is my very old Christmas bear. Some really close family friends bought me this when I was four years old and he's gotten so old, look at him. Uh, but my family, well, my mum had him under the tree guarding the Christmas presents every single year. So I'm gonna carry on with that tradition. He's gonna be under the Christmas tree this year. And then this is a tree. I think we had it at the windowsill. It's just a gold tree. I can get it open to show you. It's lovely, isn't it? Really sparkly. So I might put that in the windowsill. I put it here instead of the windowsill. What do we think? Next to the TV. And then hopefully when the, the trees... Well, I'll see what Simon thinks. <laughs> oh, and then in here we've got the sleigh. Oh, I've got this too. Have yourself a very, very little Christmas. Um got the little Mickey and Minnie on the, on the sleigh, so I'll put that in the windowsill. I think I must have taken that off last year. Let's take that off for now. I'm going to take these Christmas cards off for a second as well, just so that I can work out where to put everything. Keep snowy there. Let's put the sleigh in the middle. Perfect. I should put the snowy tree. Maybe that was in the kitchen. Oh, I think it was. I put this in the kitchen. Let's put it here. We kept those in all year round in the end. They were really nice. Let's put him in the middle. There we go. Or should I, I'll put the cactus here as well. We don't want to demote him. Squidge up everybody. So, the decks for the tree. I'm gonna get them all out. Get them out of all the packaging try and find the lights because that is the first thing that we need to do Did I, I can't remember if i oh yeah i put these on last year so basically our tree is red and gold which is why i've got a lot of red and gold and i think i just used the red and gold ones with the greens last year of those 
um, and we've got these little nice droplets, glass droplets. But I found the light, so I'm going to see if they work, because that's the most important thing. They're the ones that have one down the middle, and then they have little rings on it, so that you can get the whole tree done, which is really handy. So this is them, so the, you have one main core, and then these are the rings that go around each branch, each circuit. Right, let's see if they work. Just thought I'd film that I'm about to uh, go under the tree to club these in. Why is it that we always get so worried about whether they're going to turn on or not? Probably just because we've not turned them on for 12 months. Fingers crossed, everybody. Yay, they're on. They work. That is brilliant. Oh, they're so twinkly. I love them. It's so magical. Oh, oh you've got it. <laughs> Right. Yeah, and then... So if you just hide that around the back somewhere. Yeah, so we can't see it. And then that goes around there. Yeah, I'll fix that in a minute. And then all these are tied up. And so Sam and I have just done the lights. I think they look pretty cute. Now we're going to put up the baubles, but I just thought I'd do a quick span and show you what we've got. So this is all exactly the same as last year's. Now I think that they're the trees a bit bigger this year so we'll see how we get on um, but I'll just show you a few bits and pieces we've got Jiminy Cricket I've got the rose which actually lights up it's from the Disney store Belle's Rose uh, we've got this is from Disneyland Paris so is that we've got these from Walt Disney World we've got Mickey Dumbo and then Mickey Minnie from Walt Disney World. These two are from Inspirations actually um, that's from Hayes Garden Centre in the Lake District. These are from Walt Disney World. I can't wait to put them up. We've got all these to put up as well. I'm going to just put a few of these ones up. These ones are from Walt Disney World, obviously. <laughs> Everything's from Walt Disney World. Um, but these two actually mean a lot. These two were at the top table of our wedding. They were dangling off the edge of the table and that was at our wedding as well. So beautiful, this one. I love it. And then this is a nice big mickey one and then i've got these gold pine cones from that i got from sainsbury's last year then the icicles to go on the edge of the tree and then finally we've got the star to put up on the top so sarah and i are going to try and put all these onto the tree now wish us luck i'll pick you back up when we're finished hopefully we'll have a fully decorated tree in this next clip <laughs> oh little finishing touches looks good doesn't it yeah that's good so we've got gone golds and reds and then we've got our little icicles on as well. Oh, it pretty much looks the same as last year and that's exactly what I wanted. Here we go then, let's get this up. I don't want to... Uh... Can you manage? Yeah. <laughs> Whee! It fits. Is it wonky or... Oh, what do you think? A little bit. Is it straighten wonky? it up. Yes, please. Oh yeah, it's really wonky. I don't really know how we can keep. Oh, that's better. Okay. I think. It's the tree that's a bit wonky. Yeah. Maybe. What do you think? Ah. Try to get it all in shot. So I've moved the little uh, Christmas critters, and I've put our lovely tree skirt down. And this is it, our lovely tree. I love it. Yay, we finished. I'm so glad we've gone for red and gold. Let me know below what colour scheme do you guys have on your tree. Well, thank you so much for watching. I'm going to leave you here. Stay tuned for the next one because we're going to be going to Chester to check out all their Christmassy lights. It's beautiful there, so I can't wait to show you that. So thank you so much for watching. Like this video if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already. And we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye.